you guys, it's Kitty from Kitty Sparkle Studios, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a baby crib or bassinet using scissors, paint brushes, Pringles containers, but you can use something else. I'm going to need craft paint, ribbon, these little gems, eyeballs, beads, and thicker for decoration, which is optional, and hot glue. And the hot glue is optional. You can use other types of glue um, and double-sided tape, but I wouldn't recommend it just because it may not stick as well. So let's get started. To start with the crib, we're going to take two of these little Pringles containers and stack them up so that the bottoms of the containers are touching each other, just like this. Next, we'll take our hot glue gun, which has been heating up for a little while, and glue the containers together. So once our containers are glued together, we are going to take our crafting paint and brushes, and we are going to start painting. Of course, I recommend using a paper plate for the paint because you don't want to, like, put it directly onto your thing and then paint it. You want it to be on a thing so you can mix it and stuff. And my paint is globbing up really, really bad. I don't know about you, but if your paint is, like, really, really globby, then you might want to mix it with some water because that will probably help. So now we are done painting, so I'm going to let my masterpiece dry. Ten minutes, but you can always try blow drying it to speed up the drying process. Uh, I don't want to set a fire, so I'm going to not do that. Just let it dry naturally. Once your crib is dry, I took my hot glue gun and started adding some of my pretty ribbon around the edges to kind of clean up the edge and make it look cute because it is for a baby. I cut my ribbon, and I'm going to start gluing it around the outside. Okay, so I glued my ribbon around the top. Um, you can also glue ribbon around the center to kind of clean it up so that you don't see that line there. Okay, so now I'm going to add my little optional doodads to make it look really cool. So you can take your hot glue gun, put a little bit of glue on the objects that you want to put on the crib. All right, so now that my cute little doll baby crib is all decorated, all cute, I decided that I wanted to put a coffee filter on the inside, and you can kind of fold it around, and that helps so that the baby isn't just inside of here. You can also cut a piece of fabric or tissue paper to be like a blanket. I'm going to cut a little piece of tissue paper and add it on the inside of my doll crib. And that's your doll crib. You can add in your little baby inside of the crib. And to make a bassinet, 
I, instead of using two of these, I would just take one of the Pringles containers and decorate it the same way that you would and maybe take the other one and cut it so that it looks like this so that you can make it a bassinet. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to comment, share, and subscribe. And have a perfect day. Bye!